Hi, this is Robert with Cruise Bike, and today we're going to be installing the front derailleur stock on a Cruise Bike S40. The Cruise Bike S40, the current 2020 model, does not come with a derailleur stock installed. This is because we use a SRAM 1x system. But there is a mount. You notice there's two holes in the chainstay. This is for the front derailleur stock, should you want to change to a double crank set. The 2020 S40 comes with the cable pulley, bolt, and bearing. It comes with the complete as well as with the frame set. The stock itself, however, only comes with the frame set. If you have a complete, you'll need to contact us to order. The stock comes with some assembly parts, two bolts, a washer, and an attachment bracket. For assembly, you will need a 5mm Allen and a 3mm Allen. Here we have all the parts for the derailleur stock. We have the lower bracket. Notice it has a bevel on the end. The bevel is important as it clears the weld. It also has a notch on it that corresponds with the notch on the front of the stock. All of the parts assemble and only go one way. Note the weld here. That's why there is a bevel on the end of the bracket. Once we've assembled all of our parts, including the cable pulley and bolt and small silver bearing, assembly is very straightforward. Our first step is to take our small bracket and the small bolt that has a three millimeter Allen head. We're just gonna thread it in a couple holes and note that the bevel should face down. Now the stock will fit into the bracket and then the little tab on the inside will go right into the notch. Make sure the bevel is facing down and then we're gonna tighten this three millimeter Allen. We're gonna make sure it's nice and snug we don't have to torque this down super, super tight. We just want to have it nice and tight, but don't overdo it and damage the aluminum tube. Once that's in place, we can install the cable pulley. The cable pulley will go on the bevel side, and we will thread that in with the tall flange facing outside, as shown here, and then use our three millimeter Allen wrench to thread this all the way in. Make sure that's nice and tight as well. The remaining bolt and washer are going to install the derailleur stock onto the chainstay. We're going to get our wrench and bolt. Now notice the holes here. The derailleur stock rests right inside that hole just like that. And then we use our remaining bolt and our five millimeter Allen wrench to attach the bottom of the bracket attached to the tube from the underside of the chainstay. Using your five millimeter Allen wrench we want to make sure we tighten this bolt down nice and tight. We also want to make sure that the post itself is aligned with the boom and uh, it should be nice and straight in relation to the boom tube and the chain ring. If needed, you can give it a slight tweak over one direction or the other, but it should line up nice and straight. Now for your shifter cabling, the cable will go up over the top and into the cable stop right there. And then the bare cable will go out and then around the pulley and back to the derailleur of your choice. And that concludes the installation of the derailleur stock on the front of a cruise bike S40. If you have any questions, please feel free to email us at support at cruisebike.com. Thank you.